Let's go ahead and pull this thing up first, if we can. See, oh, there's a coin right there, looky. Good morning. Morning. What are we up to today? Oh, we're gonna go back in the crack again. Back in the crack, huh? Oh my Gina. All right, got a new adventure today. I'm back up here with Billy, Captain Billy and Torin and a big crew. We're gonna go out to uh, Mistake Island where the lighthouse uh, is and go back in the crack or back in crack. I wish I knew the words of the song, but I don't know. But anyway, we got a big crew today and we're gonna head on out there. Perfect weather. We're gonna find lots of good stuff, silver coins, all kinds of stuff. It's gonna be awesome. Back at the crack, and we're gonna have a good adventure today. We're at uh, we're on Mistake Island. So you see the lighthouse behind me. Tell me what we're gonna do. I'm telling you what we're gonna do. Hold on. There you go. We're gonna find coins. In fact, I've already found what they call a lar largy up here, uh, but it's Canadian largy. Anyway, let's look at the. Crack. Lost my audio on my GoPro for these clips, but there's a Canadian largy. I'm showing it to Torin. That's where the boat ramp actually is to get to Mistake Island. More treasure there, and we'll get back to it a little bit later. Anyway, let's look at the crack, okay? Because we're getting ready to go down in there. Me, Captain Billy, Torn, <laughs> and you. Oh. Take a look at it from the sand. You know, I never went down here before. Oh, look, there's steps. For coins in here, too, I bet. See any gold coins? All right, come on. That's a big step, so you watch yourself now. Let me go this way. Man, ah, dangerous out here. Look at that thing. That's a big old piece of metal. So, you know, the lighthouse was built back in the 1800s, early 1800s. This one, I think, what is that? Look at that stuff. <laughs> it's weird. Um, I think that one was built later 1800s anyway so what we're going to do today is we're going to go down in the crack look at it and hopefully not get sucked under into a cave and ground but for some reason i don't know why there's actually a bunch of coins and stuff in here there's stuff right there we'll look at that too tide's still going out got about another 45 minutes before it'll turn we're gonna go up in there gold coins galore my friend gold coins galore all right that's pretty cool right there if there's any uh, silver or gold in those things um all right let's start looking around a little bit up here what i'll do is i'm gonna work my way back up back to the entrance the maw of the beast we're gonna find some stuff look at that i'm just amazed at everything i see that's salt <laughs> that's wild sea salt isn't that cool i've never ever seen anything like that before that must be from the it was uh with the wind blowing and the mist coming up and then evaporating during the day creates these little pockets i bet you i bet you back in the day um they used to uh harvest that like we're going to be harvesting coins Ooh, what's that there we go oh lucky i <laughs> just like picking everything up with this nice chunk of lead there some more stuff in here of course, this could have, you know, we definitely were soldiers out here during World War II. We found evidence of that last time. And uh, there could have been pirates out here dropping coins everywhere, gold coins. That's uh, brass. Look! Now that, my friend, is rock trick. Wow! Even get out of here. I'm hoping to find like a U.S. Navy or something. A Navy uh, utensil. That's definitely not. I guess I'm just. Oh, it is! Look! What does that say? Really gentle. U.S. U.S. Is that a U.S.N.? Put a little bit of sea salt on it. There you go, Bubby. So we know the Navy guys are out here. Whether or not they were 
I mean, they probably wouldn't have a lighthouse going during a war, but they were probably out here during a war, like I said, looking for U-boats. Because the Germans were all up and down the east coast of the U.S. sinking ships left and right. And people could actually sit on the shores, and in fact they did like in Jersey, in New Jersey and stuff, and watch boats being blown up on the horizon and on fire and sinking uh, at the beginning of the war especially. Uh, most people don't know that, but there's a lot of a lot of a lot of a lot of tonnage was lost right right inside of uh, of the U.S. right in the land. But we have treasure already. Lucky, some more. It's lead. They use lead for everything. Wow. We'll look around up here a little bit longer because you know, like I said, the tide's going out, so we'll uh, we'll have plenty of time to look down in there. Let's find some more treasure. I just turned the camera off and stepped on a rock. Now I'm looking at this, look at that. I can see all kinds of stuff down there. Wow. Hey, look at that. A lot of big heavy iron, but I can see uh, there's some copper and brass in here. Look at all this stuff. This is absolutely amazing. Look, that's probably off, of, that's copper. It could easily that's a winding out of a motor. But easily be pirate coins out here, huh? Any coins are probably down deeper because they'll get wedged down in there. Giant chunk. Oh, looky. What's that? <laughs> I thought it was a pot pipe. Oh, no. It's a little uh, fitting of some sort. I don't know what that is. Probably a steam let off for a uh, steam, steam system. Should put my gloves on. But they're in my bag. Look, another one. Oh, this is so awesome. I'll get it with this. Come here, puppy. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's <laughs> rough shape, isn't it? All right, keep digging. I bet there's gonna be coin in here. Some type of fitting. That's kind of cool. Any coins? You know, there's, there's gonna be a coin in this one. There's absolutely gonna be a coin in this one. Come on. I think the coins will probably get sifted down deep pretty quick and get you know, wedged in there up, you know, straight up and down. You know, the Torn's got my bag and he's not here yet, so he's back there looking for coins where he first started. Uh -oh. oh, that's a beauty right there. I guarantee that's going to be a World War II. That's a lot of a grand, probably. We'll dig this one crack out while we're here. I gather all these. I'm gonna keep those things for now. Like some more cartridges. Yeah, so anyway, yeah, we're here with the owners of who are uh, heading up the you know preservation of the lighthouse, and they brought the parents out to see it. So Billy just got brought us all out here today. See the fog rolling in right there. That's why it's here, you know. Saw this thing, I was getting ready to pull it out. I see something shiny right here. I don't know if that's going to be a coin or something else, but let's go ahead and pull this thing up first, if we can. See, oh, there's a coin right there. Looky. There we go. Come on. You can do it. Kind of wiggle it like that and come loose. I'm not, it looks like a uh, little cupboard or something. But I see coin. I see a coin right here. What is it? What is it? Oh. I guess that's actually a washer, isn't it? I don't know. Might be some type of weird washer, or could be a hold coin, but I don't, I don't know about the size of it. The size is weird. I suspect that's a coin that's been hold. Give it a little quick cleaning. It might even be silver, actually. Get some young eyes torn on it. He should be back by now. I gotta go find him. I think there's another. I saw something else shiny in here. Some lead. That's the shiny thing I saw. It's all falling apart though. Come on. Oh, no, there it is. It's either a coin or a button or something, isn't it? Is it? Come here. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's a little <laughs> doohickey. It's not a coin or a button. All right. Let's keep moving. Put this in me pocket. Yeah, Billy and uh, Torn down in the crack. I need to get some batteries, so I'm going to go down there, too. Um, 
this horn i apparently just found a large scent uh, i don't know if it's canadian or us but let's go down there for a while because tide's going to come in that's going to be uh, off limits pretty quick but the uh where we just were the tide didn't get up that high are you ready here we go She'll shake the coins from your pocket, take your gold chain and your locket. Mother Earth has no sympathy. She'll take the ring from your hand and bury it in the sand and keep it for eternity. Mother Earth, she's got her secrets. She's promised to keep.